Hey y'all, it's Margaret. And Bradley. With the 2020 pandemic in full swing, the world in lockdown mode, and work life in flux, we decided to make margaritas out of the limes we were dealt. So we bought a 1973 houseboat in Minnesota with plans to boat it down the Mississippi River to our home in New Orleans. So grab your life vest and your beverage of choice. We assure you it will be one wild ride. have my dang breakfast and there's something delicious about my leg right now <laughs> and he is not stopping okay buddy that's good thank you thank you now it's going to get fresh air living good, the dream it's a good day <laughs> Lot 22, this is Pleasure Craft headed southbound looking to lock through. I mean, that's that barge that passes. We should have passed him. I guarantee you he's just now hitting the lock. Like, slow it down. We're not going to get through for a couple hours. I don't know if it's turned up all the way. I know that bar 
touch. It's gonna bite us. I think we can get here this quick. It's too much stuff to do. People think there's what are we doing? Too much stuff to do. I mean, he looks like he's just sitting at the entrance of it. Maybe we can go around it. Lock and Dam number 22 is located in Saverton, Missouri at mile marker 301.2. No, we're, I believe we're well ahead of them. We're ahead of Midland um, Barge. We're about four miles out, so that's why I was checking to speed up or slow down. All right, I'll look for them. That's what I'll time. Thank you. So we're about 45 minutes, um, so we'll probably slow it down. We're like four miles. We're about four miles away. We're probably going about nine miles an hour. Get this. There's no lock and dam number 23. Lock and dam number 24 is located in Clarksville, Missouri at mile marker 273.4. These, no, these are islands, okay. Well, when I was zooming way far, it showed these U's that show up really well, like these blockades. And I just saw round deals here, and I'm like, we are almost, they look like U wing dams. Oh, wow. Because I guess it pushes the water and that dredges out. This engine doesn't run nowhere near as good as the left engine. Like, there's just no way. See, it's showing us going through an island right now, but like literally, but it's 14 feet, That's 12, 11, screen. 10, 9, 8, 7, no, I'm just kidding, 14, 15. Yeah. Oh, I've got my new charts. It's got contour lines. It worked. It went up to 12 feet right oh. there. But it went from 15 to 12. I don't know if you're like, oh my gosh. It showed that it was going to rain. Oh, yeah, you did tell me that it was It's going to rain through the entire night, according to the... Should we? According to the hourlies, but hang on, let me watch radar. Depends on how it's moving, but even so, like, we're not going to get out of it. It's going to rain till about 7.30, and then we'll have a, real, a good gap till midnight yeah see these U's baby this is what I was talking about where they show up several places those are U rock like U wing dams you see that oh crazy I see it right here but I mean you can oh, yeah, you yeah. can actually see them and that's because the water's real low if the water was up you wouldn't be able to see that shit right which is why you don't want to stay the f inside of these channel waters yeah
See this little house? This is a little island in the middle of the Mississippi River. That is McCoy Island. I'm it's not kidding you. Come look. McCoy Island. Stop. McCoy Island. Huh. Uh-uh. Guess we should just go pull in then, huh? I guess so. Should we call any uh, relatives tell them we're here? We're home. Look, there's two little houses on this on McCoy Island. Island. On McCoy Island. How strange. What'd you think? Um, I think that is where we're headed in our lives, and it's good to know that we have ancestors that have already, you know, laid the <laughs> the groundwork. Yeah, for put us. in the groundwork, laid the path for us. Look at this. So there's little islands on the Mississippi River. This is one of them. But I have yet to see any inhabited or any structures. Yeah, we've never seen any structures and there's two little homes. Can you say homes? Like deer stands, camps? But leave it to the McCoys. Old McCoy. Go out there and live on an island on the river. Yep. <laughs> this must be a new f beach because it's showing all rocks. I want to make sure that I don't put us in the channel, which this is probably not wise to be here. Otherwise, this is a phenomenal beach. Do you want to try this beach? I don't understand what I'm looking at. It makes it look like it's rocks. Is there rocks on it? It's only 6.30, but I mean, that's a great looking beach. Here it's showing like it could be some kind of rock barrier. There's definitely a crane sitting out on the far, far end, so that's not too Gucci. I don't know how much I trust this map. We've been trusting it the whole time. Not the whole time. We haven't had this one. I mean, check this beach out, babe. It looks pretty cool. I mean, I see rocks behind it, but not on Well, I see them to the far right of it, and I see some bounce down there, but... I mean, we make it come up all the way around it. And then we'd be out of the Mississippi altogether because I don't know. That'd be kind of fun. Well, I just don't want to get us stuck. Like this crane is sitting out. Like a bird crane? Yeah, he was. Now he's flying right at us. Now he's flying away from us. I think we gotta keep going. I mean, there's beaches everywhere. I mean, this is a huge beach. This will be fun when we get the weather right tomorrow. So this is 263. If we were trying to get to 180, well, we could have we could do it Sunday, but we don't. We're not even trying to get to 180. So. How many miles did we go today? 320 and. Um, so right now we're at 57. We went 70 yesterday, didn't we? Yeah, but we ran it harder. It's only 6.30 right now, too. Do you want me to keep running a little while, or what? Well, are there beaches up ahead? I think there's beaches the whole way. I mean, we've got, we've got room. It's only, it's 6.30, so we got time. Okay. I don't really want to go much further. Yeah, I don't either. That's why I'm looking even now, but. I don't know why this shit's vibrating all of a sudden. It's getting humid. Yeah, I don't want to be anchoring in the rain anyway. I told you it stopped about 745, so let's keep pushing. This is a great beach right here. Uh, no, I want to go further like we said. I think there's be there's been beaches everywhere down here. Once we get past Hamburg, there are a bunch of wing nails we gotta watch out for.
Bradley is swabbing the deck while it's raining out. Right before we try and find a place to beach tonight. It's been really muddy, so everything's all gross outside. So we're trying to keep it clean so we can keep the inside clean. Yeah, I see it. He's working hard. There's not a lot of downtime. I thought that there would be a lot of downtime. Uh -huh. So I'm driving the boat. I haven't given an update in a while. But one of the things that my friends had been asking, like, what are you gonna do with all this time? And there's really not a ton of free time. Like driving this boat, you have to do it super, you have to really pay attention, don't you, babe? Yeah, boat looks like it's, looks like it's year 1973 again yeah. on that deck, baby. Oh, good. Got it. Um, you have to be paying attention at all times. There's no cruise control. The current will pull you. The wind. The too. wind will pull you. You've got to watch out for these wing dams. You got to go through the locks, which a lock and dam is where the elevation changes in the river. Barges, Every... other boats. Yeah, barges, other boats. Lots of different things that I hadn't really anticipated. I thought I was going to be doing yoga and watercoloring and reading and having, she, she, yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm doing those things, but not as much as I thought I would. See, that looks like an island. Does that look like, I guess it could just be current sitting there on the front end of it. I mean, we'll be pretty well protected if we... This thing's still not... This GPS is off. Something happened. I don't know what. Like, this thing's not... I've moved way more than what it's claiming. And it, now, f***ing out, it's low voltage because I got two... See now it's showing me like in hitting this island again. Like it's not there's just no way this thing's f***ing out here right now. We're 4.7 feet deep. We may be only four feet's a lot. That's up to my tits, but we may have to walk in depending on how quick it raises. You know it, babe? Yeah. Just a heads up. Three and a half feet, three point four. 3 what we're about to hit, what we're about to hit. One six, one five. See, see how it's swirling right there? That should be. I mean, I feel protected as hell, though. Wait, as long as we can get out point nine. Yep, we just hit. Okay. Hold on. Do you want to go maybe? Well, I mean, we're, we should be on mud right now. Will you get the. Okay, thank you, Ponce. Go kennel now. I told you to go kennel. Will you do me a favor and grab the. Um, will you grab the flagpole and see yes. what we're dealing with? Because I don't want to. I don't, yeah. Like that, it's this light. I can push through all of it. But we don't need. Yeah, we don't get stuck. We may need to go to a whole other. Thing. I should have done it anyway, but. Yeah, we can't stay here.
You don't know till you know because I don't have contour depth lines on this thing. I could have gotten them from other charts because like how we just did that, that records it and sends it back to Navionics and then you can load other people, they can load my chart up without having to look for me. It just puts it in the system so if you choose an area, it just tells it. Yeah. I mean, how gorgeous is that? What's that? Just oh, yeah, I'm just it's looking at it. It's really beautiful. Yeah. It'll be even more beautiful when we can, like, stop. Well, it's going to be nighttime, unfortunately. I was, I was apologizing. I'm slowing us down, babe. What's that? I'm slowing us down. You're slowing down? I'm slowing it down. Why? Because I can't see. Okay, I got it. Hold on. I see this. There's a green blinking light over on the bank over there. It's raining heavy again. <laughs> oh no. What? We have some rain. Uh. It's just when you're blocking my entire view and it's okay. nighttime and I'm trying to do this. See, look, there's a damn orange buoy I'm headed straight at. See any beaches over here? No. Where's that red bacon here? Over here. Okay, what color is oh, that? Oh, that's green right there. What the Looks like they're running. Isn't this light moving? Um, yeah. Yeah. So while running. 
lights matter, babe. So what color is that? That's red. That's red. Yes. And what color is that? That's red. Right All there. Right. You see this map right here? All it shows is a green, which would be to my hard right. But GPS could be a turn in the punch bowl for all I know. <laughs> see, I don't, that looks like that should be a rock wall over there or something. I want to go to this island, but the beach is one on the other side of it. I don't yeah. see any wing dams. It shows this heavy line, which I don't know what that means on here anymore. I thought it used to mean rocks, but... It's either a sandbar or a rock wall out to our left. But I don't see any markers here that tell us that we're in danger. We're at 21 feet. And it gets us out of the channel. So let me. It's got one of those weird little. Where did that red marker go? Do you know? Okay, it's right here. Right there. Close to the trees, or do we want to go? Is that our own waves doing that to us? I guess so. Right now, it's 15 feet deep. It's coming up hot, 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 hot. Oh shit. We're at seven feet. We're at seven feet. Shit. So we're at seven and a half feet. We're at five feet. If we have to just anchor and stay here tonight, then that's what we'll do. I just can't see anything. Like that, that's like a fucking, So that's rocks. That's rocks. me. So aboard, 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 right? Yeah. Is there any chance that... I don't know where that red buoy is. Way, way, way behind us. Okay. Is there any chance that this is not rocks? Do you want to go see if any of this is, if there's beach anywhere? I don't see any beach. I think it's all rock. The back side of it, if we'd have gone around it that way, I think, and I still think we can do that if you're game. Okay. Look, you see this? Mm hmm. See how this GPS is showing us backing off a completely different way? Now they're showing me going forward, but my depth's still not changing. Lots of like, you're about to hear that red buoy go like, cling. <laughs> this GPS isn't picking up what we're doing at all. It's just Here's what I need you to do then. Okay. If you can come spot check this island, which now we're just now getting to the land, so it's gonna come a lot longer. I'll keep watching our depth. You want me to and my goal is to get us on the other side of the island. And talk to me while you're okay. communicate with me. Let me know what the you're only thing that I see are the things of the rocks. It's just rocks? Well I can't it's so foggy over here. Yeah, but I mean, hell, the current state, like, we're not even going forward right now because of the dam. Like, doesn't it look like we're just sitting st even with the damn yeah. trees? Yeah. I'm going to have to give it some gas. The fog is really setting in. I know. I can't see shit. 
You're gonna have to, cause between this GPS shining in my face and the jumps up quick or anything I don't see any wing downs which is what matters the most if we hit sand if we whatever we'll throw an anchor out and we'll just stay out here okay that's it definitely comes out this way and yeah, that could be that's gonna just be current right so that's that's one oh we're gonna drive the boat yeah see it's 3.2 3.1 which out we're about to be stuck we're about to hit something 2.3 2.2 we're I think we may be stuck now, huh? Well, I don't have it in gear, so I'm just cruising ever so gently. 1.9, 1.8, 1.7, 1 1.6. We're probably just going to stay out here. Okay. The thing is, I don't want to even get stuck here. Like, it's... Right. You know what we need to do? What? Get that flagpole. I'm not in gear. I don't think I am. I'm not in gear. If you want to just get the flagpole and we can start stabbing. Okay. Yeah, we should have stayed. Up here. Hit it anywhere. I mean, it should all be one feet. It's huh? It's yeah, but how? Oh, it's way deep. It's, see, it's telling me, Margaret, that we're at one. I just need a depth. I know it's going to hit. Okay, so that's hitting at a foot. Just like any kind of lake or anything else, we're just gonna anchor out and we'll be good. We're fine. We're we're good here. Did you turn? I see. Oh, look at that crane. Oh shit, we we were in the bank. Well, hell, I meant to get us way further around the right side. We were. I guess we were just drifting here. Is what was happening. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's some beach. Right there. Right there. Is it beach? Yep. No. A log. Right there, that's beach. I mean, it's grass and beach. Well, look, I'm either gonna pull into this thing and okay. just rock it, yeah, or, let's pull in. or I'm gonna put an anchor out here and we're not gonna mess around with anything. All right, so somewhere around here, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so if you wanna do a depth check with that flagpole, the problem, I mean, we're at 1.7 feet, so we may not get to this beach. Now, if we wanna walk to it in the morning or tonight for ponds and your purposes, But I, it's, it's the same situation we had before, like when you just get stuck out here. Well, let's just anchor then. I'm not trying to get stuck. It's four feet. Jeez. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, I need to drive the boat. Yeah, I'm trying to steer it. That's all four feet. Fuck, I wish I'd have gotten more left before we floated in. Shit, I'm like, I don't know. I don't want to back up I know. Look back in. I don't know what my back end's doing. I don't know why either. Shit. This is a big 